This is going to be a video about owning my awkwardness because there's no other way to get around it other than to just accept it and carry on. There's going to be several examples of how I am awful at just being a normal person in this world. Here we go! One that is not clearly apparent from my videos is that I do stutter a lot and I have trouble getting my words across so I usually just end up going like <laughs> I'm a very klutzy person. I trip and I walk into things on a daily basis. It's a bit of a problem when it comes to me being up high in places, and I will tell you a story of a near-death experience that I've had because I was such a klutz. The way that my school is set up is that there are a bunch of hills and there are stairs that I need to take to get from my building to the main hall area where I have most of my classes. Walking up the stairs to my class, I get to the very last step on there and I trip. I caught myself, so I didn't do a complete face plant, but it was enough that the group of guys that were standing a bit off started to laugh and just do a slow clap like this. It was brilliant. And then I just, I pointed at them and I said, thank you! I'm here all week! This one just happened the other day, and it was it was really funny because Annie was telling me a story. I decided, even though I wasn't there, I would like recreate him walking and opening the door for her. So I went to do this, and I fell on my face. I just fell on my face, and there were a whole line of people, and <laughs> he was just standing over me. I'm on the ground laughing, and you're not supposed to be on the ground when you're in your chef weights. It's supposed to be like totally business professional environment. And here I was, sat on the ground, dying laughing. These two girls, they didn't know whether or not to laugh at me or not. So I got up, turned around to them, and I said, Go ahead! Laugh! Laugh at me! The big instance where I almost died from being a klutz was in Pennsylvania. There's this place called Devil's Den. So I was there with my friend Dylan and my friend Paige. And Devil's Den is really cool. You can climb all these different rocks and stuff. So I was climbing the rocks. I had done it before with Annie when I went to visit her in August. I tripped and I my leg went off of the rock and there was a good 10 foot drop <laughs> down there. And I got this massive bruise that was about this big on my left knee right there. <laughs> I just kept climbing. I'm like, oh hey, nearly died, no big deal. Let's continue on. So about two minutes later, two minutes, I was making a jump from a rock to another rock and I lost my footing again. If my friend Dylan hadn't caught me, I would have been dead. Yeah, that happened. I'm gonna continue on with my video if that's alright with you. No? Did you want that rice on your dresser? I did. Okay, That's good. exactly where I wanted. Good. Another thing that I do is that I don't match when I wear clothing. Beep! Beep! What else? What else do I do that's awkward? Live. I'm num num? Well, I figure that's enough <laughs> social awkwardness for one day, so I'm gonna leave you with this, and I will see you next time. By the way, this was no way my idea, so I blame it fully on Annie.